In this video, I will show you how to set up parental control on Xbox Series S. So let's jump straight into it. So in order to do this, as you can see, we're here on my Xbox dashboard. Now, what you're going to want to do is come into your settings. So if you come up to the top right hand corner and you can see the gear icon, just press A on your controller to come into your settings. From here on this menu on the left hand side, you want to come down to account, the second option, then you want to press right and then go down to family settings and then press A. So there's a couple of things you can do on here to set up parental controls. Now what you can do is set up a pin. As you can see, I've already got a pin set up for this account, but by setting up a pin, what it does, it basically allows any purchases made to require a pin or account credentials. Any changes to account settings requires a pin or account credentials. Also, launching Microsoft Edge requires a pin or account credentials. So you can see there's a couple of things you can do by adding this pin. So if we press onto this option, and what you want to do is press the option which says change my sign-in and security preferences. And you want to make sure it's set to ask for my pin at this point you'll be asked to enter a pin and that's going to go ahead and add a pin so when there's certain things being done for example trying to change account settings or making purchases or even using the microsoft edge app that pin is going to be requested before access is granted now what you can also do on here is come down to the access restrictions just down here and what you can do is create an access pin so if you press onto this and again you can use the same pin as the one you created or you can choose something else so i'm just going to go ahead and put something in and once you've added a pin, if you press right on your controller, you can see we've got this option here which says access to content is currently unrestricted. So if we press A onto this, and you can go ahead and set parental controls. So you can see, for example, we can change this to appropriate up to a certain age, let's say age 13, for example, and it's gonna tell you what can be accessed. So in this case, for example, the only things that can be accessed is games for ages 12 and over, films for ages 12 and over, TV for ages 12 and over, music for ages 12 and over, and apps for ages 12 and over. So what this means in this example is any games or apps or films or anything like that that is rated at Peggy 12 will be accessible to everyone. However, if the game or app or something like that has a higher Peggy rating, so it's like Peggy 18 or something, then it's going to need the access pin. So that is how to set up parental control on Xbox Series S. With that being said, I hope this tutorial did help you out today. And if this did help you out, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like, and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial, and I will see you in the next video.